So this is what I look like now. Today is the 4th of August 2018 and uh, yeah, welcome to my weight loss journey. <laughs> so this is what I look like now on your right and the before on your left. So I the, film, the video you're about to see right now, I actually filmed it about or almost three months ago and I just added this clip at least just so you can see what I look like now. Enjoy! Hi everybody, so welcome back to my channel once again. My name is Price and I hope you are all doing very, very well. So we are back in the kitchen once again and I'm going to start with my day as usual. We are doing another another intermittent fasting milk plan idea. So I have here some ginger. Um, you guys know I love my tea. So uh, I'm going to start with my ginger. So add some water. So I have about three uh, cubes of ginger in there and that's what I'm gonna start with, all right? So that's my tea right there. So I always make my uh, ginger tea from fresh ginger. I have a video on how I prep it and make it so much easier, especially in the morning. So um, yeah, and I also want to tell you guys, if you are not within your fasting period, you can add some honey to your tea and ah, it tastes so good. My first meal, I'm not gonna be uh, cooking at all <laughs> because we're gonna have some salad. Yeah, so I have here some salad and um, some lettuce, and I have some uh, chicory. I think that's what it's called. Um, I'll put the right name there if I got it wrong. All right, and then I also have here some onions. I do love onions a lot. Uh, a little bit of a tomato, some pepper, and I'm going to add a little bit of shito into it, which I will show you in a day. All right, so yeah, that's my salad right there. And I'm um, sorry, <laughs> Liz. Okay, so and I'm going to add a little bit. I hope this is the only avocado I have that is actually wrapped. So I hope it's good because it's looking a bit like it's about to die on me you know <laughs> so yeah that's my avocado hope it's still good if it's still good i'm gonna add it but if it's not good then yeah we're gonna have to do without it so this is radish <laughs> which i got wrong earlier anyway it does come in varieties too um by the way guys you can use any other salad you can even use spinach you know or any raw vegetable that you can actually eat raw to do this all right it doesn't have to be all this stuff that i'm using here so yeah so this is my shitor. I made it with some uh, coconut oil, some spices and dried fish. Yeah, it's very easy to make. I'll definitely show you how to make it. This is my avocado. Mm. It's actually looking very good. It's right. It was ripe like four days ago and then I pop it in the fridge and uh, luckily it's still doing very well. So we're going to add that definitely. So wash all the all your stuff and then chop it up the size that you actually want them to be. And then our salad is... We need there <laughs> all right so there you go um so i like shito in my salad uh it just i don't know it makes it taste so good <laughs> you can actually use any other salad cream you want guys all right you can just be mindful how much you put in there all right anyway there you go i have my avocado going in right now i think this is like the best thing in that uh, meal right there <laughs> Anyway, so there you go, guys. So there you have it, guys. Um, yeah, it's ready. And I guess this is the point where I say you are invited if you can. <laughs> So there you go. Um, it's very simple, very quickly. It's a large bowl. Yeah, it's a lot. As you can see, this is the kind of uh, food that you have a lot to eat, but at the same time, it's very low in calorie. I mean, the this is awesome because it's going to fill you up really well. So, yeah. <laughs> I hope you enjoy this salad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I eat within a six hour period and then I fast for 18 hours. Depending on the day and how I'm feeling, I can move my time forward or back. But most of the time, I eat between 12 to 6. 
So it is time for my next meal and it's going to be steak and chips. So I have here some uh, steak, beef actually, and I have some broccoli, which is going to be my main vegetable. And I'm going to cut it into pieces, add some salt to it. And I'm going to add a little bit of water because I just want to steam it. It takes about two minutes, two, three minutes to uh, cook. And then I'm going to, I have here some potatoes. Um, I'm going to fry my potatoes with some coconut oil. So peel your potatoes and then you're going to cut it into the shape of our uh, chips so you can use a uh, uh, yam for this you can use um, purple uh, purple potatoes you can use plantain you can use anything you want really uh, for this so it, it really depends on what I have in my house and that's what I'm gonna use all right so today I have some uh, white uh, potatoes so I'm doing a proper chips <laughs> and I am going to fry it in my active fryer with uh, about 15 mils of coconut oil all right so you can do this mix it with oil and then uh, put it in the oven all right it's just a way of cooking where you save um your you reduce the amount of oil you use all right so you're gonna fry it and then it takes about 18 minutes or so so i have here my steak at the end of my uh frying when i'm frying my steak i'm going to add a clove of garlic all right so peel it and then i'm gonna crush it um and then just throw it in uh, almost when i'm almost done frying my steak Sometimes I add a little bit of uh, rosemary or thyme, you know, but today I'm just gonna add some salt, all right? Um, so put salt on each um, side of the steak, and then we're gonna use a, just a little bit of coconut oil, you know, heat it up, and then we're just gonna uh, fry our steak. So sometimes I do fried fish, and sometimes it's uh, jerk chicken wings or something like that, you know, it really depends on what I have. Um, so yeah. Um, there you go fry your steak <laughs> on each side I usually this steak is actually very thick um, and I like my steak very well done so I've, I've just fried it for like three minutes on one side right now and I'm doing so on the other side as well so I'm gonna go ahead and actually uh, slice my meat just to speed it up a little bit it's better to actually just allow it to cook like this because then you're able to keep all the juices inside but I ain't got time for that so <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna slice my steak okay and then I'm gonna uh, throw it back in the pot uh, in the pan and uh, finish cooking like that all right it doesn't take time it's pretty quick at this point I know some people will eat this like this but uh, no not me <laughs> I can't <laughs> anyway throw you all back in and add your garlic at this point I actually almost forgot to add my garlic here <laughs> so but I got it in time anyway so I added it So here we are, my chips are ready, golden delicious. And as you can see, they are actually uh, like crispy on the outside and then the inside is really nice and fluffy. I don't know where that one went, honestly. Mm. I, I don't know. Uh, uh, another one? Hey, is that how to taste food? Hey. So the shitter is for my crunchy uh, broccoli and uh, yeah I added extra spice and trust me the shitter is even hot enough guys <laughs> I just love my uh, pepper so much <laughs> and I added a little bit of ketchup to go with my chip so as you guys can see here it's really uh, all about the portion size for me you know um, I'm a very short petite lady yes I move a lot I don't run <laughs> miles or anything like that but I walk a lot and also I mean come on I have three kids so you could imagine I'm very active in my life 
things in general all right so and sometimes you know when i feel like i i need it i feel like i want to eat more i tend to add extra of the vegetables than maybe the chips or something like that all right so uh <laughs> it was very delicious <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video um as usual i'm always gonna keep giving you guys recipes i hope you enjoyed it and i will definitely be showing you guys how to make your sheet or it's very simple um <laughs> with simple ingredients so i'll see you in my next one thanks for watching bye